Other common causes of defects include complex architecture or code, lack of domain knowledge, and technical limitations like programming language constraints. Do our mistakes matter? Let's think about the consequences of mistakes. We agree that any human being, programmers and testers included, can make an error. These errors may produce defects in the software code or system, or in a document. If a defect in code is executed, the system may experience a failure. So the mistakes we make matter partly because they have consequences for the systems for which we are responsible. Mistakes are also important because software systems and projects are complex. Many interim and final products are built during a project, and people will almost certainly make mistakes and errors in all the activities of the build. Some of these are found and removed by the authors of the work, but it is difficult for people to find all the mistakes while building a product. Failability is compounded when there is a lack of experience or when right information is not available. Available information is misunderstood, or if we are careless, tired, or under time pressure. All these factors affect our ability to make sensible decisions. Human brain either don't have the information or cannot process it quickly enough. Additionally, we are more likely to make errors when dealing with perplexing technical or business problems, complex business processes, code or infrastructure, changing technologies, or many system interactions. This is because our brains can only deal with a reasonable amount of complexity or change. Will all the defects lead to failure? Mistakes in software, systems, or documents may result in defects, but not all defects result in failures. We could argue that if a mistake does not lead to a defect, or a defect does not lead to a failure, then it is not of any importance. We may not even know we've made an error. Example. Say traffic signals are controlled by simple software in a busy crossroad. Due to an error in the program, all the directions see red signal between 12 a.m. to 12.15 a.m. every day. This may not lead to a failure as signals will be set as orange light blinking during this period. However, if the same error sets the red signal between 12 noon to 12.15 p.m. every day, this leads to a failure in signaling and may cause major accidents, which can be as serious as leading to death.